Hello, sports fans and football fans and Stratomatic football fans. I'm here again with the Sportsman Z Football League. And uh, as you recall, that league is this right here. And I'll break it into the conferences that I did. Um, and I am controlling at various times in various weeks uh, either the 2005 Chicago Bears, who are right here, or the 1984 Birmingham Stallions, who are right here. Now, currently, the Bears are 3-1. and one. Birmingham is 2-2. Two and two. Um, And this week, the Bears play the 1977 Pittsburgh Steelers. And that is an interesting game. So that's the one I'm going to put up. Now, you can see that the Pittsburgh Steelers are also 3-1. and one, So something's going to give here. Now, the Steelers' defense is going to be good. The 1977 Steeler defense was very good. The challenge that I can see the um, 77 Steelers having against us is that the 70s was an era before the West Coast offense. So um, if quarterbacks threw the ball, they threw it downfield. So they had a lower percentage com of completions and... Um, and that is particularly probably true even on the flat pass. So their passing wasn't really um, that great. Although the trade-off on that is that the running was the running games were much better than the running games of today. So we're going to see what happens here, uh, and we will light it off, and let's see what we got. Um, we're going to change the. Um, we're going to change the Birmingham game to autoplay and then let it just give us the Pittsburgh-Chicago game to play myself. So it's running the games. And we will be able to see whether the Stallions have caught up to us the stallions are now three and two they won so the bears to stay in first place alone will have to beat uh pittsburgh so let's get into that game and uh let's see yep that's what we got we're gonna launch the game we're at home <clears throat> and we are going to kick off And they got a great return. And let me see. I got, I'm going to go up here to reports. And um, I'm going to go to play percentage. Well, let's, let's view card image. All right. And we'll bring that down. We'll bring that down here. And let's go to to view so far today and we're going to move that over here um yeah yeah let's move that right there i'm not doing anything with that so here we go um i am going to Defensive formation, I'm going to start with the balanced. I always start with the balanced just to kind of feel things out a little bit. And they're going to get six yards. All right, so they have, Pittsburgh has a second and four from their own 38. Um, I'm going to go with the run. I'm just going to put in the run. And, uh, ah, no, we got them in the backfield. All right, nice. So they got a third and three at their 39. Um, yeah, I, I'm still going to go run. I, I, this is an era of running the ball, so, uh, they're going to probably, yeah, they got a big completion. 
Well, wait a minute, though. No, they got a big completion, and they're not going to fumble the ball at the end of it. So, yeah. All right. Uh, lesson learned. I'm going to put in the run. And they did get zero yards, so they got a second and ten now at the at our forty-two yard line, at the Chicago forty-two yard line. I'm gonna put in I'm gonna put in pass. Let's just see if maybe he's passing right now. Yep, yeah, it's gonna be incomplete. I got him. Caught him passing. All right, so they got a big third and 10 at the Chicago 42, and I am going to put in the pass. I'm not going to double-team anybody. I'm just going to put the pass in, and it doesn't look like they're going to get a good result there. No, no, Bradshaw's going to run the ball, and we're going to sack him. So I expect Pittsburgh to punt, and that's what they're doing. I'm going to put in the punt return. And uh, it's going to be a 43-yard punt with to the number two back, who is Bobby Wade. I'm going to return the ball. And he's going to get nine yards. Looked like 13 at first, but nope, it's going to be nine. So we have a first and 10 at the Chicago 18. And I am going to go off tackle with Jones, Mr. Joe O. And we're only going to get one yard. All right, so this is a good time to introduce our offense. Halfback, you got Thomas Jones. Um, blocking back is Mark Edwards. The quarterback is Big Kyle Orton, who completed 51.6% of his passes that year. Mushin Muhammad is out on the split end. Then on the line, you've got left tackle John Tate, um, who was very good. You've got Reuben Brown at left guard. Olin Krutz, who was also very good at center. This was a good offensive line. Terrence Metcalf at right guard. Uh, Fred J. Miller at right tackle. Desmond Clark at tight end. And Justin Gage is the flanker. So let me try a flat pass to the tight end, Clark. And that's going to be incomplete. Thank you, Mr. Orton. All right. Uh, let's see here. We have a, uh, yeah, we got a third down, third and nine. Let me see if I can. Yeah, let's put in Grossman for this pass. And let's go short pass to the flanker gauge. Uh, quarterback flushed from the pocket. But he's going to get a six-yard completion out of it. That, unfortunately, will not be enough for a first down. It will be enough for us to punt the ball away, though. So we're going to punt on fourth and three from our own 25. It's a 44-yard punt with a two-yard return, it looks like, is what it's going to be. There's 9.59 left in the first quarter. We do stop them quickly. So they've got a first and 10 at their own 33. I'm going to look for the run, make it even that much harder on them. I'm going to make it hard on them to run because the completion percentage, and let's take a look at all of that. Uh, let's take a look at the Steelers' offense, which we did not do when they had the ball first. You got Lynn Swan at flanker. You've got Benny Cunningham at tight end. Larry A. Brown at right tackle. The guard is Jim Clark. Center is Mike Webster, very good, all-pro Hall of Fame center. The guard is Sam Davis. Left tackle is John Kolb. You got Stallworth out at the split end. 
And now you got here you got Terry Bradshaw, Hall of Fame quarterback, completion percentage 51.6, so similar to Orton's. Um, Rocky Blyer at uh, halfback and Franco Harris at fullback. Defensively, the Bears line up as uh, left end Adalwe Agunlier, um, left tackle Tommy Harris. Uh, Tank Johnson is the right tackle. Right end is Alex Brown. Lance Briggs at linebacker. Brian Erlocker at middle linebacker. Hunter Hillenmeyer at linebacker. Charles Tillman at left cornerback. Safety is Mike Brown. Chris Harris at free safety. And Nathan Vasher at cornerback. Actually, these teams match up really well. I mean, both Orton and Bradshaw are bad at completing, you know, percentage of passes completed. <coughs> um, both uh, the Steelers have a little better running game and both have a very good defense. So um, I'm going to look for the run again. I think they're going to probably try to run again. I was wrong, but it's still going to be incomplete. Nice. So it's third and eleven. Now I am not. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put in the pass. I'm just gonna put in the plain pass because I think when you put in the pass and you double team somebody and you're wrong about who you double teamed, that gives them a better chance. So anyway, um, I am actually going to decline the. Now nah, you know what? I'll knock them back. I'll knock them back, and now they've got a. Third and 21, and obviously I'm going to put in the pass. But uh, they would have had, they would have been punting from pretty good field positions. So I wanted to knock them backwards a little bit. Now they are going to get a 13 yard completion, but that's not going to be enough for the first down. And um, they're going to have a fourth and eight from the 35. So really they, they'll be punting from about where they would have punted had I not accepted the penalty anyway, I suppose. 41-yard punt with a um, number two back. And that is, again, Bobby Wade. And I'm going to run again. And it's just going to be a fair catch. Uh, ball on the 29, first and 10. Ball on the 24. Well, I'm going to accept the penalty. So we've got a first and 10 um, at our 29. Let's try a long. I'm just going to throw a long out there and see if they're even ready for it. Uh, they're ready for it. Uh, let's try an end run with Jones. He's going to get four yards. That's not really great, but got a third and six at the Chicago 33. I'm going to go flat to the flanker. And that's going to be seven yards, and that should be a first down for us. And it is. Okay, first and ten. Let's go off tackle with Jones. Got to get that running game going. You got to make the Steelers respect the running game. He's going to get six yards. Real respectable yardage there. Um, we'll go out of that formation, but let's see if I can put somebody else in. Uh, I'm going to put in Adrian Peterson. And then we're going to go line buck with Peterson. And uh, he only got a yard. Got a third and three at the Chicago 47. I guess we're going to go flat to the tight end Clark. And that's going to be eight yards and a first down. Nice. Okay, and if you're following along, Orton so far today is 2 for 4 for 15 yards. 
and uh, that was uh, Clark's first reception. So we got a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 45, and I'm going to go end run with thank you, Benson. Let's see what happens there. He's only going to get maybe a, a negative one. That's what he got. We got a second and 11 at the Pittsburgh 46. I'm going to go short to the split end. Short pass, split end, 14 yards, baby. All right, we're moving. We're moving on this uh, steel curtain defense. We've got a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 32, and Orton is 3 of 5 for 29 yards. Let's go line buck with Benson. And it's going to be a yard gain. So we got a second and nine at the Pittsburgh 31. I'm going to put in the pro set. And we're going to... We're going to do a uh, look-in pass to the split end, Muhammad. And that's going to be seven yards and not a first down, but... It'll be seven yards closer for Robbie Gould if we have to kick the field goal. It's a third and two from the Pittsburgh 22. And I am inclined to say we're going to go to the pro set and then we're going to go line buck with Jones. And he's going to get five yards on a first down. I don't think Pittsburgh was ready for that one. So, Jones today has four rushes for 16 yards. Um, we're going to do a draw play with the halfback, Benson. Now, that ain't going to do a lot. No, nope, it's going to lose two yards for us. Second and 12 at the Pittsburgh 21. Um, I'm going to go line buck with Benson. They shouldn't be ready for this. Well, uh, they really will be. We got the yard back, uh, or one of the two yards back that we lost, but it's 3rd and 11 at the Pittsburgh 20. Now you're just launching a short pass to the flanker. And he sacked, immediately sacked, and now we have to kick a field goal. But this is Robbie Gould, so I am going to do that. And the kick will be good. Up and good in Chicago ahead 3 nothing. I thought we might get a touchdown that time. So we're going to kick off to the Steelers. They're going to get a 25-yard return. from Smith. That guy is a good returner. All right, so the Pittsburgh has it first and 10 at their own 33, which is a common starting point for them. Uh, I'm going to put in the balanced again. Never really seems to work well for me, but we'll see. Five yards, you know, they got five out of it. Now I am going to put in the run. I think they're going to run now. And they're going to get Zipola from that. And now they got a third and five. Pittsburgh does it at their 38. And I'm going to put in the pass. And, uh, yeah, they got seven yards out of that. All right. Um, they got a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 45. I'm going to put pass in again. Uh, we're wrong. And they're going to get a short gain out of it. And 11 yards. Well, as short gains go, that's actually pretty good. From our standpoint. All right, so we they've got a first and 10 at the Chicago 44. I am going to put in the run. And we were right. And they're going to get two yards out of it. So, second and eight from the Chicago 42. I'm going to put in the run again. 
we were right again. And they're going to get zero. Rocky Blyer caught right at the line. So they got a third and eight now, and we are going to put in the pass. And uh, quarterback flushed from the pocket, and uh, it looks like he's going to get a receiver, and it's going to be incomplete. So they will punt to us, it looks like, again, and I'm going to put in the punt return. And that's going again to Bobby Wade, and I am going to try to return the ball. And he is going to get nine more yards, which is good. We got a first and ten at the Chicago 24. I'm going to go draw play with Peterson. And he's going to get four yards. That's not bad. I'll take it. Second and six at the Chicago 28. I'm going to go line buck with Peterson. And he gets one yard. So we've got a third and five at the Chicago 29. I'm going to go flat pass. Flat pass to the split end. It's receiver, and it's incomplete. So we're going to have to punt. I expect this game is going to, I mean, this is two good defenses, so I expect this game to be a lot like it has gone so far, a very low-scoring affair where a big mistake could decide the game. So, And we got a terrible punt, 36 yards, and it's going to be an 8-yard return on the back end. 9.22 left in the half. And he has a first and 10 at his 43. I'm going to go looking for the run again. And he's only going to get a yard. Um, second and 9 at the 44. I'm going to look for the run. And he gets five yards out of that. All right. Uh, third and four. I'm going to look for the pass. And I was right. And he is going to be incomplete, and he'll probably punt again. Bradshaw today is only two of five for 32 yards. Let's see. That's what I'm talking about. Whoa, he's going for it. I'm going to I'm going to put in the pass. Oh no, wait. He got a first down. What was there a penalty or something? I don't know how he got a first down out of that. All right, he's got a first and 10 at our at our 38 or our 36 he started. Now he's got a second and 2. I'm going to put in the run. He gets zero, and so now we've got a third and two. I'm going to put in the run. Well, it doesn't matter. He's going to get two yards, and that's what he needed for the first down. First and ten for Pittsburgh at our 26. I'm going to put in the run. 5.49 left, and he's going to get five yards with Rocky Blyer running the ball. Second and five at the 21. I'm going to put in the run again. I'm going to put in the run, and I'm going to key on Harris. And they're going to get zero. All right, so third and five at the Chicago 21. I am going to put in the pass and hope that it doesn't just automatically somehow become a first down when he doesn't get it. Although he might get it here. Receiver. He is going to get it. He's going to get a six-yard completion. Uh, 
All right, so they've got a first and 10 at the 15. Now, see, I, if that happened last time, I didn't see that happen. But anyway, we're gonna, I'm, I'm just going to put in the balanced. I don't know what I'm doing here. Short gain. They're going to get a short gain and maybe even a touchdown out of this. Yeah, they will. <clears throat> so they're going to take a... Oh, wait, I'm going to accept the penalty. All right, good. So now they got a first and 20 at the Chicago 25. I'm going to put in the run. They get four yards. They've got a second and 16 at the 21. I'm going to put in the run again. Oh, we're wrong. But it's going to be intercepted. So we're going to have, uh, we stopped them. We stopped them because they had a key penalty and then an interception. So uh, 3.05 left. I'm just going to eat the clock here. Because we don't have a quick score offense. It's not like we have the weapons to say, I'm going to go right down the field. And we're going to get a 27-yard gain, though. Which is nice. All right, well, we're at midfield now. I don't know now. Maybe we switch to the pro set and uh, try a short pass to the split end, Muhammad. It's going to be incomplete. All right. Oh, wait, I'm going to accept the penalty. If the Steelers keep making penalties, they're going to kick themselves in the butt. It's first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 38. So I'm going to go back to the pro set. And we're going to do a short to the uh, to the flanker. It's going to be incomplete. They were wrong, and it's going to be incomplete. All right. Uh, let's go draw play with Jones. And it's going to be a short gainer. That's, are we going to need a big one? 16 yards. Going to be a 16-yard run for him. That puts him squarely in uh, Gould's uh, kicking range. Two-minute warning, first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 22. I'm not going to take a timeout, and I'm going to go to the pro set, and we're going to try to launch this thing into the end zone. Uh, he's going to be sacked. Well, now we got to try to get back into, uh, we got a second and 16 at the Pittsburgh 28. I've got to try to get this closer again for Gould so that he has a better chance of making a. Third and 15. I'm going to go to the pro set and then we're going to go off tackle with Jones and he's only going to get three yards but we got a fourth and 12 at the 24 fourth and 12 at the 24 he wants no he doesn't want me to go for it right yeah he wants me to kick all right so I'm going to kick it with Gould this should be a fairly good chance and it is going to be good and we've got a 6 nothing lead. I know I was kind of playing for the, uh, you know, for the field goal there. But again, this is I think this is going to be a real low-scoring game. And I think that the Steelers' offense against my defense is going to have a tough time scoring. 37 seconds left in the half. Another good return for them. First and 10 at their 34. Now I am just going to put in the pass because that's what they should be doing. What? They get a long gain? Are you kidding me? A 31 yard completion. All right. I mean, I'm going to put in the pass again. And 
and now it's going to be incomplete. All right, so second and 10 at the Chicago 35. I'm going to put in the pass. And it is going to be incomplete. And they got a third and 10 at the Chicago 35. With eight seconds left, I'm going to put in the pass. Pass defense. They're going to get a yard. No, they're going to get some more. They're going to get... Why did that say only plus one? All right. Um... They're going to try to kick it with Roy Jarella with one second left. I'm going to put in the kick block. Well, he's, he's going to make it. That wasn't a gimme, but he made it. And that'll be the half, I believe. And it is. And uh, they're going to kick off to us. We're only going to get a 12-yard return. So we're not quite to the 20. Let's take a look at the stats here at the half point. Um, box score. Let's move it out of the way here. So... Um, Bradshaw is 4 of 10 for 69 yards and an interception. Orton is 4 of 8 for 36 yards. And uh, Grossman's 1 of 1 for 6 yards. Running the ball, mainly they've got Harris at 14 attempts for 51 yards. And we've got Thomas Jones at 8 attempts for 63 yards. And Cedric Benson at 4 attempts for negative 1 yard. And Adrian Peterson, three attempts for six. And there's the receiving stats and Gould and Jarella kicking. So anyway, that's where we are. Um, I'm going to put in the blocking back like it, they suggest. I'm going to go line buck with Jones. going to do a conservative offense here. I'm still winning the game 6-3, and we do get six yards out of that. Second and four. I'm going to go line buck with Jones. Ah, uh, he's going to lose a yard. All right. Second and nine. Second and nine? How did it go second and nine on losing a yard? All right. Um, I guess there was a penalty, but they I didn't see the flag. We're going to go pro set. Flat pass to the split end. And it's going to be incomplete. And third and nine from the 19, we're going to go, yeah. And we're going to go short pass to the split end, Muhammad. Receiver, and it's going to be 14 yards. With no fumble. Good. So we do get the first down, and we keep the clock running. I mean, that keeping possession is the big thing. Uh, line buck with Jones. We're running Jones into the ground, but hey. And he's going to get zero yards. Keep that clock moving. That's what you got to do. We're going to go pro set, and I'm going to go off tackle with Jones out of the pro set. And we're going to get three yards. Third and seven at the Chicago 36. Um, yeah. Let's go flat to the tight end. And he's going to get 10 yards. Nice. Like that. All right, we got a first and 10 at our 46. Let's 
go line buck with Jones. Again, conservative offense, eat the clock, try to get some yards while I'm doing it, but definitely eat the clock. Um, let's go pro set and flat pass to Jones. I've been accused of not passing to the running backs very much. So let's do that, and we're going to get a seven-yard completion out of it, which is not too bad. All right, so we got a third and three at the Pittsburgh 47. Um, all right, I'm going to go out of the pro set. We're going to go flat pass. Now let's go look in pass. We're going to go look in pass to the flanker. He was right. I knew he would be looking for it. And it's going to be incomplete. Now my question is, do I go for it on third and three at the Pittsburgh 47? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go for it. I shouldn't, though. He hasn't really. He's only scored a field goal. Uh, this is a tough one. But I'm going to do it. I'm going to go for it. Pro set. Flat pass to the tight end. Ah, it's going to be eh, nothing good. It's going to happen there. And he's going to intercept it and return it 25 yards. So that was really a horrible decision for me. Put that one on me. He's got a first and 10 at the Chicago 29. I'm going to look for the run. And I was wrong at that. And then he's going to have an 11-yard completion to add insult to injury. Oh, all right. I'm going to accept the penalty, though. Again, he's 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 just taking himself out of this. Uh, he's got a first and 20 at the Chicago 39. I'm going to look for the run. And I was right. And he's going to get zero yards. And I'm going to accept the penalty. So now we're just knocking him backwards. He's got a first and 30 at the Chicago 49. He's back to almost midfield. Um, I'm going to put in the 3-4, though, and I'm going to look for the run. I probably shouldn't, but I am. Oh, my God, he got a 42-yard completion? Are you kidding me? <sighs> oh, boy. All right. I'm going to look for the pass. We're wrong. Might as well be now. Touchdown for them if they didn't have a penalty, and they didn't this time. Uh, I'm going to put in the kick block. And it's going to be good. So they're ahead 10-6 now. All right, well, now we've got to try to score. Touchback. The kickoff will be a touchback. I mean, it's still a low-scoring game. We're in the uh, we're in the third quarter with eight twenty-eight left, and it the score is ten to six. But uh, let's go line buck with Jones. Well, he gets four yards. We got a second and six at the twenty-four. Let's go with the pro set and uh, end run with Jones. And uh, four yards. No, no. He got a nice gainer on that. That wasn't even one of the choices I saw. But anyway, so we've got a first and 10 at the, the uh, Chicago 38 at our own 38. Um, Let's go line buck with Jones. We're still going to try to keep the conservative offense in there, eat the clock, 
do the things that we need to do, but um, I'm going to go to the pro set and we're going to go flat pass, flat pass to the halfback. And it's only going to be a one yard gain. Got a third and nine at the 39. Yeah, now you got to really open it up a little bit. We're going to go short to the flanker gauge. And not a lot of good choices there. It's going to be incomplete. Oh, I'm going to accept the penalty. Thank you, Steelers. So we've got a third and four now at the Chicago 44. I'm going to go pro set and flat pass to the split end Muhammad. Still not a real good chance, but it is seven yards. We get the seven yards and the, uh, and the first down. We've got a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 49 just crossed into mid or just crossed over midfield. Let's go off tackle with Peterson. They were wrong, and we're going to get six yards out of that. All right, we've got a second and four at the Pittsburgh 43. Let's go pro set, flat pass to Jones. And we're going to get five yards out of that, and that's going to be sweet. First down. Got the first down. We got a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 38. Let's go off tackle with Peterson. That's not going to be good. One yard. All right, we got a second and nine at the Pittsburgh 37. Go back to the pro set. and We're going to go end run with Jones. He should be wrong, and he was. And we're going to get five yards out of it. So we got a third and four at the Pittsburgh 32. Um, going to the pro set. Look in, pass, flanker. And it's going to be five yards and first down. All right, so Orton today is 11 of 18 for 85 yards, zero touchdowns, and an interception. And Gage has two receptions for 12 yards. So um, we're going to go draw play with Peterson. And he's going to get three yards. All right, I'll take it. I mean, we're back in Gould's territory, um, but really we would like a touchdown because it's 10-6. A field goal still has us down by one. Um, I'm going to go look in pass to the tight end, Clark. Or, yeah, down by one point. Receiver. And it's going to be six yards. I'll take it. Third and one at the Pittsburgh 18. Yeah, let's go there. Let's go line buck with Jones. Uh, well, he's going to get a yard, and that's all we needed. So first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 17. I'm going to go off tackle with Peterson. Hope he's wrong. I don't know. Now we're going to get two yards. 37 seconds left in the third quarter. It's 10-6, and we're moving the ball. We have a first or a second and eight at the Pittsburgh 15. Going to go pro set, short pass, split end. No, they're going to sack him. They always sack him right when I try that. All right. Um, we're going to go short, we're going to go short to the wide receiver, Benson. No, nope, they're going to, well, wait a minute, what are they going to do? We're, he's flushed from the pocket. And he's going to get a 16-yard completion, people. And that does get us a first down deep in their territory. First and goal at the Pittsburgh 5 with a quarter left in the game. Um, going to go line buck with Jones. 
keep hammering it. Just keep hammering it. And he's going to get nothing. Second and goal, we're going to go pro set. And I'm going to go draw play. No, I guess I can't do that. I'm going to go line buck with the halfback Jones. And he gets the touchdown, and we take the lead again. Nice. Had to do that. Let's kick the extra point. The kick will be good. And we take the lead again now. 14 minutes and 11 seconds left in the game. And we are kicking off with a 13 to 10 lead on the 1977 Steel Curtain Steelers. <coughs> Another pretty good t return, though, for them. All right, so... He's got a first and 10 at his 38. Always starts right about there. Um, I'm going to put in the run. He can tie it with a field goal and go ahead with a touchdown, obviously. He's got a second and nine. I'm going to look for the run again. Intercepted plus 15, possibly, but no, it's going to be incomplete. But I'll take the incompletion. All right. Um, we're going to, we got the nickel in there. I'm going to put in the, the pass, and I'm going to double team Swan. Quarterback flush from the pocket, and it's going to be incomplete. So we stopped him again. Again, low scoring game. It's only 13 10. And we are going to put in the punt return. Forty one forty one yards back to twelve forty six left in the game. Bobby Wade again. I am going to try to catch it and return it. And he just gets a fair catch. He had a chance for a touchdown, so you always want to do that. All right, yeah, we're going to keep the blocking back offense out there and line buck with Benson because, hey, we're just trying to eat clock. We want, we want to keep the chains moving, but second and seven at the Chicago 23 for us. I'm going to go flat pass to Benson. Well, that wasn't the greatest idea. Incomplete. Got a third and seven. Now we're going to go uh, flat pass to Bradley. And we're going to be sacked. All right. We're punting again. <laughs> Need a good one here. 43 yards. And an eight yard return. That's not going to be particularly good combination for us. So they're going to have it first and ten, just about mid, almost midfield. First and ten at their 49. I'm still going to look for the run because that's their bread and butter and that's what they got to do, but we're wrong. But they're going to be incomplete even with us being wrong. Maybe they're feeling the uh, the sense of urgency now. I don't know. But now I am going to put in the pass. And they're going to get six yards out of it. Third and four at the Chicago 45. I'm going to look for the pass. And they're going to get seven yards. 
First and 10 at the Chicago 38. I'm going to look for the run. They've still got time. There's 931 left. And I'm going to get four yards out of it. Second and six at the Chicago 34. I'm going to look for the run again. We were right. They're going to get three yards. So they got a third and three coming up. Third and three at the Chicago 31. I'm going to look for the run. And they're going to be incomplete. They're going to pass it and be incomplete. Now the question is, what do they do? Can they kick a field goal from there? They can, probably, and they will. And we're going to put in the kick block. Going to try to tie the game. And it's a bad kick, and they will not tie the game. All right. First and 10 for us. 737 left in the game, and we're up 13-10. And uh, why the heck would I do that? I'm going to go off tackle with the halfback Jones. They were right, but we got six yards. A fumble has occurred. And it's going to be covered by them. you got to be kidding me. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. None of that happened. We got to, well, I guess they had a penalty. All right. Uh, we're going to go draw play with the halfback Jones. Again, I didn't see the flag or anything, but, you know. Second and five at the Chicago 43. We're going to go pro set, flat pass to the flanker. And it's going to be intercepted four yards downfield. Of course it is. All right. We've got to go back to trying to stop them again. Uh, I'm going to go with the run. There's 6.39 left in the game. And he's going to get a 19-yard completion. Did not need that. Uh, I'm going to go with the run. Uh, and 9-yard completion. We're oh Man, we're self-destructing right here. Second and one, we're going to go with the run. He gets one yard and he gets the first down. First and ten at the 14, I'm going to go with the run. Negative four, needed that. All right, so he's got a second and 14 at the Chicago 18. I'm going to look for the pass. Must run for Bradshaw, and he's going to get 10 yards. Come on. All right, third and four at the Chicago 8. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look for the pass. you gotta, you got to look for the pass here. We're wrong. Great. But he's only going to get three yards out of it. And now will he kick the field goal? Yes, he will. And it is going to be good, and he's going to tie the game at 13 with 3.15 left. And we're going to get a 25-yard return. It's amazing how the computer just happens to come up with all those mistakes, like turnovers and stuff, when you're poised to win the game. All right. Uh, let's go to the pro set and uh, short pass to the flanker. Incomplete.
Oh, I'm going to accept the penalty. Steelers, they could be kicking themselves in the butt here. Pro set and short pass to the split end Muhammad. And he's wrong. But it doesn't matter. It's Orton. Going to go pro set and we're going to put um, Grossman in. And um, I'm going to go short to the split end. And he's going to get us 13 yards, people. All right. So we've got a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 44. We only really need a field goal. I am going to, I'm inclined to say I'm going to call a timeout. We're going to put in the pro set. I'm going to put in, I'm going to put in Grossman. I like my chances with Grossman better here. And then we're going to, um, and then we're going to do a flat pass to Jones. They were right, but it's going to still be receiver. And 41 yards! Can you believe it? Because I can't. And we're going to be right down there. Yeah. All right, we got a first and goal to Pittsburgh 3. And uh, I'm going to say no time. And we're going to go line buck with Jones. And he was keyed, so he's going to lose a yard. But really, all I'm trying to do is make them spend time. Uh, off tackle with Jones. And he gets the touchdown. So now Pittsburgh needs a touchdown. We're going to kick the extra point. I didn't, I mean, I would have been happy with a with an extra with a field goal but the kick is good and uh so we're ahead 20 to 13 and we're kicking off and they're only going to get a 14 yard return that's one of the worst returns on that list for them except for the fumble which would have been nice um yeah, and they're, they've got a first and 10 at the 20, and they got to go all the way down for a touchdown. And I'm definitely looking pass. And it's going to be incomplete. And it's second and 10 at the 20 for Pittsburgh, and I'm going to look for the pass. And it's going to be incomplete. And we're going to look for the pass. Let me see. What do I want to do? I'm going to look for the pass. And they're going to get four yards running the ball. And fourth and six, they got to go for it. And I am going to look for the pass. And uh, we've rushed him from the pocket, but he's still going to get thir 13 yards. But he's got a first and 10 at the 37 with uh, 30 seconds left, and I'm going to look for the pass. We're going to make this very difficult on him. Receiver and 19 yards. Man, he's not done yet. Oh, I'm going to accept the penalty for sure. So now he's got a first and 20 at the Pittsburgh 27, and I'm going to look for the pass. The further you can make him have to go, the better off here. He's got a must run, and it's um, going to be Bradshaw running for 18 yards, if you can believe that. All right, he's got a second and two. I am going to look for the pass. I know that he could probably run the ball and get the first down, but that's still going to eat a lot of time. There's only 15 seconds left. And he gets 31 yards out of this. I was right. And he gets 31 yards. All right. Uh, 
He's got a second left. Going to look for the pass, obviously. And it's going to be incomplete, and we're going to win the game. Game over, people. So let's take a look at the final stats. Um, the box score we'll just look at real quick. Final score, 20 to 13 Bears. Bradshaw was 10 of 24, 179 yards and an interception. Orton was 13 of 23 for 107 yards and two interceptions. Grossman was 3 of 3 for 60 yards. Franco Harris had 21 touches for 80 yards and a touchdown. Thomas Jones had 21 rushes for 104 yards and two touchdowns. Peterson had seven rushes for 18 yards. And uh, Cedric Benson had five rushes for two. I'll let you look at the receiving stats. I don't generally go over receiving stats. Although Stallworth was impressive, four catches for 59 yards. Um, and that's going to be it for me. Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.